Yeah, Mender is much less useful than I was hoping he would be. I'd rather have this guy. This guy's way better. So what should I do with him? That guy's up for attack, so it definitely wouldn't hurt to get his shit lower. So yeah, let's just go ahead and attack him. You are going to go ahead and finish him off. Nice. Damage bounced. No nice dodge. How far away are those guys before they move? Alright, he's about to do that strength buff. And then they'll just murder her. That's what I don't like. Is like Now it's like, well, I'm afraid to put her anywhere because she's just going to get annihilated. Well, she needs. Well, she's pretty much done as far as helping with these range units. So she's going to have to start getting over here, helping with the melee. How far can these guys move? All right, I want to move her around the back. And try to help over here. Getting hit by either one of these guys will be instant death. Well, no, not quite. Yeah, it will be. This guy will kill her. And this guy will bring her down to one health. Which, again, almost worthless because her ability is more useful than hers. But I still don't... Well, I need to get in range because that's his her purpose. Ah, shit, of course they're next. Why wouldn't they be? I really only need to be in range of one of them. Nope, neither one of these is helpful. I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs> can't use too bad you can't use the trap on the tile they're on. I presume you can't. Yeah, it wouldn't make a lot of sense. So I can either bring him down to eight. God, a lot of fucking math you had to do doing this. Eight, eight, nine, ten, level twelve. Bring him down to eight, which means he would do four damage. Four to him would mean that he's doing eleven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, or seven, eight, nine, ten. So do seven damage. So how much did I say for him? Fuck. <sighs> So much fucking math you gotta do to figure out how to do this game right. Five. Five damage. Oh no, yeah, yeah, five damage. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. No, seven. Three. So let's do. Let's attack this guy. Bring his damage down as much as possible. Wait, who's next? So this guy's definitely going to attack next. So there's nothing we can do about that. So let's attack him and bring his damage down. How low do we need to get to get him to get at one? We need to get him to four. That's not gonna happen. Uh, do eight damage. I don't want to use all of it, but I guess she could rest a few rounds. But we really, we got to keep her high strength. That was the right guy, right? Oh, that's right, and he moves when we do that, too. So, that helped. I forget about that. That actually worked in our favor again. I like, I like when their abilities work in our favor. Alright, so we're going to go up. We are going to do this. We're going to do... Oh, my fucking god. The game really needs to undo. Holy shit. God fucking damn it. Well, he's down. Uh, Mender, I guess you'll... 
go to the back. Actually, it's so hard to calculate how far your abilities can actually hit with this grid system. So if I move over... Because I want to move far enough away that he can hit them, but at the same time not be hit himself. So if it's diagonal, it's one... Two... It's hard. One, two, three, I guess? So if he's like one, two... Oh my god. Let's just move here and hope for the best, I guess. It's, like I guess it's so hard to tell. I guess I could try it this way, like, alright. Try to move, like, in my brain, move the grid over. So, if I move over, I can't see, this is lit. So, if I move over two squares, I'll still be able to hit him. And back a square, it looks like. So, if I move over two and back one, I should still be able to hit him, I think. Yeah, there we go. All right, we need to start putting the woes on these assholes. Now, it better actually hit diagonal this time. And, of course, it hits your own guys. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? All right. But, damn, we put... We hurt that guy pretty bad. I kind of want to just run him in there and... Like, beat the shit out of him. How much willpower do you have? Three? How much can you use? One? Because, I mean, lowering his strength isn't really going to help us much. Ooh, you can do nine damage to him, though. You could actually do ten damage to him. Which would be pretty damn nice. Yeah, so many people at low strength. So if I do 9 damage to him, it's only leaving him with 6, so he can only really do 1 damage. Obviously this guy's gonna... I don't know, hurt that bad. Let's do that. I'm only gonna do the 9. What's her armor break? One. Oh, God. Yeah, like these, like, that's my problem with this strength equals damage thing, or health equals damage, is like, once her health gets lower, they feel completely worthless. Like, she can't even armor break well. But I might have to sacrifice her to do that. She's got six, but she can only use one. Yeah, let's get him some armor low so we can try to take this asshole out quick. And that pushes him back. I keep forgetting about that. Alright, if you want to do that, that's fine. Who's next? Uh, it's hard to tell. Yeah, it must be this guy. Yeah, it's got to be this guy. So with that, I'm trying to decide if I want to move up further to do more damage to him. I mean, well, we can't do, we can do like one damage. We can do armor break, I guess. Sad having to do armor break when they have four armor.
But yeah, I mean, otherwise she's she's not going to do any damage to either one of them. Well, any significant damage. Let's do this, actually. Who's next? This guy. I know if she moves up, he's just going to like walk away and smack her and kill her. Now well, let's try it anyway. We're going to have to make some sacrifices here. Lower his armor by three. Yep, and it was exactly what he was going to do. He can only do one to each one of these, though he could kill her easily, if we're not careful. In fact, he most likely will. Because the thought, the thought process is this. Either A, go over here, use our mark ability or whatever, and this guy will be able to kill him. Or go here, use it on him. She's not going to do shit for damage, though, is the problem. Because she's only got one. No, she only did do one damage, so it's not really going to help. Either way, she's probably going to die. I guess I could try to block, but that's not going to work. She's just walking around. So the choices are do a little bit of damage to this guy. Maybe. And still have him kill her. Because all he's got to do is one hit point of damage. And you have to roll the dice on the RNG for her to deflect, which she probably won't. Or flat out kill this dude. And one of these two is almost certainly going to die. Nothing really we can do to prevent that. Because unless we can get his health to like one. When does this guy go again? Actually, you know what? Here, if we do this, if we finish this guy off, he will get another turn before him, so he could come up and whack him. Okay, so let's do this then. You're going to move over here, not diagonal this time. You're going to mark prey. And he should finish him off. I forgot about the stupid bomb things. Alright, he's in deep shit. Alright, so the Mend... <laughs> mend only does <laughs> armor equal to half our current willpower. Which, uh, in itself is... <laughs> my god. Alright, um... Short ally armor. Half above plus two armor. So that would be... Four... I forget what his max is. What's your max armor, son? It's not six. Nope. My bad. All right, let me click this. All right. So only well, it's actually eleven. So eight, nine, ten, seven, eight, nine, ten. So four. Yeah, actually, because we've got to keep him up because these guys are boned. We've got to make it as difficult as possible for them to take him down. Even though this guy is a... Shit, see, that's the other problem. Oh, God, he's only got two... Because uh. you've got to get these get these guys killed as fast as possible, and then waylay this tuner guy. This guy's going to kill him regardless. Then his next attack. When is that? Mender's next. Then this guy... So 
this guy's sort of late in the movement. So it's Mender, this guy, this guy. So... He's not going to be able to finish him off now because he's taken so much damage. But if we, I'm trying to think of, I'm just, what I'm trying to think of is, is it even worth it to mend his armor or should I just lightning the shit out of this guy or this? No, he's too far away. gonna try moving up and lightening him how much does it do four or five that's not gonna be really enough to finish him off but it would be enough to seriously hurt him but if we don't the problem is this guy's dead like a hundred percent and again he's kind of worthless now because he's only got two strength Uh, sorry it's taking so long, but I don't want to lose this fight just because this asshole. The other good thing is this guy is going to break two of this dude's armor. So it'll bring him down to two, but it's not going to help us a ton given our current situation. I wish you could kill him outright with the lightning, but it's just not enough. I only did four damage. Ah. Uh. I mean, he's at least still somewhat useful because of his armor buff. But she's pretty much worthless. I just don't think if there's any worthwhile reason to mend his armor. See, so it would get two. You only really need to do two because it's like max armor was like what, eleven. So even if we get into eleven, he's gonna do three to him, which is gonna kill him. Man, I wish men did strength instead of armor. Like that's. Like, not even close to what I would have rather had. Like, under, I, I assumed Mender meant strength, because that's so much more useful. Um, there's no way we can kill him either. And of course, none of these guys are diagonal to each other. I think I'm just going to try to lightning this guy to... To get his... I mean, I really need to lightning him, though, because his armor or his damage is so high. But then... I don't even know if moving here will, will put me in range. Yeah, it should. Because basically our hopes are going to revolve around him at this point. Yeah, let's try that. There's a pretty damn good chance we're going to lose this fight, though. Of course! No, he's just out of range. Uh, of course. Because, yep. Alright, well. Go ahead and... Hurt him at least before you get killed. Because it's going to be him or her. One of the two. Oh, wow, he actually does good damage. Well, we're boned. He could kill him. He's way... Rook is too far down the line to really make use of the one ability. But at least we keep these two alive for a little bit longer for whatever that's worth. Now watch him miss with 80%. Oh, we got him. Yep, now he's dead. Oh, you can actually hit her? Or, oh, okay. I was going to say, you can hit him from here? Man, I can't believe Mender heals armor and not strength. 
Huh? Oh no, it can't do it diagonally, that's right. <sighs> you would, you prick. The hell was that? Guess he does some kind of dot or something? Well, she's not going to be in range of either one of these guys. Well, that makes that not very useful. Put him right here, I guess. I still don't get why sometimes it's green. Well, at least we can do a little bit of damage, but you're, we're fucked at this point. Oh, it's the Mender. I was like, why can't I can't hit them? I was like, oh, because it's the wrong person. Again, I want to move and try to lightning, but I don't know if it's... I mean, right here would definitely be close enough. I, got, I mean, I got I would hope so. so hard to tell the range of spells. Like I said, I would hope that would hit. It's like one, two, three, four, five. I mean, we're definitely would be, well, no, we have to, we need to move over. I mean, if not, I guess I just make makes the choice easier because I have to hit him at that point, but I don't know why I'm wasting my time. We're Pretty much fucked. No, okay, he can hit him. Alright. So he can do... Wait, he's only got exertion one? Damn. Oh, well, that's right. It's a spell. It's different. We need every little bit of help we can get here. You got a 50 50 shot. I'm doing one damage. Huh. Ugh. We'll have to play the odds and just really hope the RNG is in our favor. Nope, it is not. Well, that was all she wrote. Oh, apparently he was dotted, yep. Yeah, that's it. Shame we got killed by the damn range guy. <laughs> yeah, attack that 40%. All right, just everybody run in and get murdered, please. Yeah, I'm gonna start bring stop bringing Alette. She's pretty useless. Oh, I don't want to put willpower on there. <laughs> Would you just? Attack and kill her, please? For God's sakes. Oh my God, just kill her, please. Stop fucking around. I'm gonna make them earn it. They're gonna be dickheads about it. I <laughs> just run away. 
Just kill her, for God's sakes. Yeah. Well, that was pointless. Yeah, I'm definitely taking her out of the party. Yes, all right, we get it. So it wasn't long for the stone, blah, blah, blah. Iron Harf quickly falls behind the hand of the bar wipe from the history. The oh, okay. So that I mean we have to do that battle again, I guess? Ugh. Return the last checkpoint? Sure. So I guess we either have to win that fight. All right, let's blow through this quickly. Hurry up. Yes. All right. Nope. Yep. Nope. We can skip this. Skip this. Hello. Uh, I'll pick you guys out once this unskippable thing's done. 